remove the leaves from the broccoli and also the chunky stem part as well. Then you're going to do the same with the broccoli, remove any leaves and just do it into small chunks. So once that's done, you're going to get your food processor and you're going to half fill it with the broccoli. Well, not half fill it. Take out half of the broccoli and cauliflower and place it into there and you're going to now put the lid on and you're just going to pulse this because here on most blenders you've got food processors rather you've got a P which means pulse and you're just going to pulse this about 10 to 15 times until they look like small rice grains. There's always going to be a big chunk that doesn't want to break down. Let me see if we've got any. Actually, no, that's not bad. I think just once or twice more and we're good to go. Yeah, so you can see it kind of looks like grains of rice, more or less. They are like that even be a bit smaller but it's never going to all be uniform because it's just yeah so break it down just like that so now we're going to put it into a pan and do the rest of the cooking so just put a little splash of olive oil or coconut oil into a pan and let that heat gently for about a minute and then we're going to add our broccoli and cauliflower that has been riced So once it's all added to the pan, and give it a stir. Now we're going to add our chopped yellow bell pepper. So you add the chopped yellow bell pepper, and this gives it a nice, rich colour. Stir that in and let that cook for about three to five minutes. You can also add some mixed herbs and some salt and pepper. So once it's been cooking for about four to five minutes, three to five minutes, then it's ready. You can switch it off and you're good to go. Tasty.